Good morning. My name is John Whitmayer. I'm the Director of Music Ministry at Salem Lutheran Church and School in Afton, Missouri, and it's my privilege to bring you a devotion this morning. Today's devotion comes from our friends at the Wells, the Wisconsin Evangelical Lutheran Synod. Today's Pentecost devotion is based on Acts chapter 2, verse 4, which reads, All of them were filled with the Holy Spirit and began to speak in other tongues or languages as the Spirit enabled them. The devotion reads, Have you ever experienced a language barrier? I was traveling in a foreign country and found myself at a loss for words. I knew what I wanted to say. I even tried as I pulled up the language learning app on my phone. But either a poor translation or mispronounced words made the native speaker laugh instead of understand. The barrier still remained. Those language barriers have existed ever since the Tower of Babel. Early in human history, recorded in the Bible, everyone spoke a common language. However, when they united around a sinful purpose, God said, Come, let us go down and confuse their language so that they will not understand each other. And that barrier has remained to this day. Those language barriers are also a reminder of a bigger barrier that once stood between us and God. That barrier didn't cause embarrassment or confusion. Sin once separated us from God eternally. But the Spirit of God breaks down those barriers. He broke the barrier of language on Pentecost, 50 days after resurrection, when he sent the Holy Spirit. All of a sudden, the language barriers were torn down by the Spirit. Jesus' disciples were filled with the Holy Spirit and they were able to speak in other languages. Travels from all over the world heard the good news of Jesus in their very own language and the barrier came down. By the written word of God, which has been translated into your language and many more, the Holy Spirit is at work to tear down that barrier that once stood between you and God. By the good news of Jesus that you hear and read in your own language, the Spirit creates and strengthens faith. In your very own language, you hear the good news that no barrier remains between you and God because Jesus paid your price. Jesus was crucified for you. Jesus was raised to life for you. Sin no longer separates you from God. It has been taken away. Would you please pray with me? Come Holy Spirit and tear down the barriers I have created. By your word, strengthen my faith to know the love of God and complete forgiveness I have through Jesus Christ. Amen. Thank you so much for listening and watching this morning. May God bless your Monday and your entire week. Thank you and goodbye.